Hey there, how you doing? This is Adam Rafferty, funky finger style guitar player out of New York City. And my video today is uh, an answer to a question that I get constantly. And uh, I just kind of wanted to put it all out there. What kind of guitar do you play, Adam? Now this might be obvious to some of you who are guitar freaks, but it's not obvious to everybody, so I just wanted to describe it. I'm going to give you the link. I'm going to describe my experience with it. This is a, I'm trying to get it all in the camera. This is a Maton, M-A-T-O-N, not Martin, Maton, Michael Fix model guitar. I believe it is EBG808. C. And Maton is an Australian guitar company. And you might have heard of Tommy Emanuel, Michael Fix, Joe Robinson, and plenty of other plenty of other people. Those are just the first guys that come to my mind. They play Maton guitars. And the question is, well, why do I play it? First of all, there's lots of videos. I'm I'm on YouTube playing a couple different guitars. That was sort of my quest, my search for a guitar that worked for me. Now, this is actually my backup. If you ever see the video where you have these nice two tones on the side, that's my backup guitar. Uh, my current, my main guitar is actually in the repair shop right now because I did percussion and cracked the whole side open. But <clears throat> they're set up exactly the same. I have two Michael Fix model guitars. And here's the deal. Oh, let me just give you real quick. The top is made out of spruce. The sides, back, and I think the neck are made out of Queensland maple. It has an ebony fingerboard. It has a cutaway, hence the 808C, because I like to play up high and this makes things easy. The 808 is just the Tommy Emanuel model. Long story short, this is the best sounding plugged in guitar I've ever played. Uh, the, the pickup system is called the AP mic. So there's an under saddle bridge thing and a microphone. And I blend the two. It's just, when I go on tour, I plug into a DI box on the floor, maybe a little bit of reverb. And within a few minutes, we're getting a great sound coming through the PA system. I've had really strange experiences with other guitars where no matter what we do, it just never sounds right. This thing sounds awesome, plugged in, okay? So if you're a person that plays plugged in, this is a terrific, terrific choice. It's not the loudest guitar acoustically because it's not designed to be a big, boomy, resonant guitar because that would actually lead to a lot of feedback on stage. It has um, a very tight little focused sound but it's the right sound especially for fingerstyle. Now a small body guitar is nice for fingerstyle because you get kind of a balance. The, the lows don't boom as much as if you had a big dreadnought which is more of a strummy boomy kind of guitar. I prefer this for fingerstyle so that the bass and the treble are more balanced. Here's the deal. Um, yeah, I'm a Maton artist. I bought my guitars, and the guys at Maton don't even know that I'm doing this video. <laughs> they, they didn't put me up to it. I'm not getting anything, you know, for it. I'm just putting the good word out because everybody says, hey, what kind of guitar do you play? And I really do play them, and I really do like them. And uh, they totally, they travel well, they do the job on stage. So there you have it. I'm going to put a link below so you can check them out. There's a few dealers in the U.S. who've got them. They're a little tricky to get in the United States, but if you call around, you can find them. Good luck. If you have any other questions, feel free to give me a jingle, give me a, an email, and I'll be happy to answer any questions that you may have. So... God bless, and go get yourself a mate and guitar. Take care. Bye-bye.